My agent called me and he goes, I have a script you have to read. And I was said, God, I can't have time to read anything right now. And he goes, no, this is you. So I said, okay, and I put it off a day. And he said, all right, it's time sensitive. And I said, okay, so I picked it up and that was it. It was me. It, it, it's, this is my sense of humor and my tone right down the middle. So we just, we made it work. When I came across the character of Sue Buttons in the script, Alice and Janney immediately popped into my mind. Like it was her, the whole, after that page, I could not get her out of my mind as that character. And it just, it plays into all of her, her skills. Um, Allison can do anything, and, and this was a movie in which you can do everything tonally in one scene. It's a lot of hard work, but, but that's, that's just who it had to be. It's just one of those rare movies that it, it seems like they just don't make them anymore, or they're too hard to make, and, and just great parts for women. And, and John and I, my partner, have set up kind of, we call it film camp. We're here in rural Mississippi. We all stay together and break bread together, and it's just a blast. One of the key themes for me is, is avoiding becoming irrelevant. Um, no one wants to be irrelevant. No one wants to be invisible. And, and as we all know, we're, we're, we're guinea pigs in this great experiment called social media and, and iPhones. So we don't know what is happening to us. But uh, I, I think with everybody's need to be liked and friended and people are feeling left behind or irrelevant. And it's, it's how we deal with this, this time and technology. It's fun, it's crazy, it's violence. But with Allison as Sue Buttons, there's a pathos to it that it bring, your, your heart's gonna break for her. You're going to understand this feeling of feeling inadequate and, and overlooked. And I think that's when you can bring in the drama to a black comedy and find that, and thread that needle perfectly, it, it, it's a winner.